you're watching this video, there's a good chance you or someone you know has what is commonly referred to as man boobs. And while this can be a sensitive subject because it involves body image, sexuality, and gender, we will address this topic based on questions and language we commonly receive. Most men want to get rid of man boobs simply because breasts are associated with the female body and are not masculine. Having man boobs visible through a t-shirt, dress shirt, or shirtless at the pool or beach can be a confidence killer. So instead, what these men want is a lean, muscular, well-defined chest that we often see in movies, ads, and pro sport events. This video will detail the seven most effective steps to get rid of man boobs for life. Not only will these steps eliminate man boobs, but they'll help improve your overall health and physique as well. If you've been looking for ways to get rid of chest fat, you probably heard the term gyno. So let's begin by making a clear distinction between general chest fat and gynecomastia, or the more commonly used term gyno. Gynecomastia is a condition of overdevelopment of the breast tissue in men or boys. Unlike overall chest fat, this can be breast tissue that develops beneath the nipple. As a result, the breasts become more prominent, more pointy, and may even grow unevenly. Hormone changes often cause these changes in breast tissue. While there are cases where the cause is unknown, gynecomastia is often caused by changes in the female hormone known as estrogen and the male hormone known as testosterone, but it can be caused by other things as well. On the other hand, overall chest fat can make your chest sag and give you the look of man boobs. This fat is similar to the body fat around your stomach and lower back and can be reduced with the right lifestyle changes, which we'll discuss later in this video. Now let's get into the seven points. Number one, get a second opinion. The first step is a quick but important one, and it's to get a second opinion from a friend or a family member that you trust. As men get into fitness, some start to get overcritical of their physiques and become overly self-conscious to the point where they begin to see things that aren't always there. In the scientific literature, this is referred to as body dysmorphia. Body dysmorphia can be a muscular bodybuilder who thinks he's too small, or a thin woman who believes she's not slim enough. When taken to an extreme, these dysmorphias can lead to physical and psychological problems. Unfortunately, we've seen guys do the same when they think they have man boobs. Get an opinion from someone you trust to ensure that this isn't just in your head. Then if you do indeed have man boobs, continue through the following steps. Number two, consult with a doctor to get your hormones checked. Step number two is to see a doctor and get blood work done to check your hormones. Most articles and videos on the internet will jump right into diet and training, which we'll cover in the following steps. But it's incredibly challenging to build muscle and lose fat if hormones like testosterone are in the gutter or your estrogen is very high. Ask to get your total and free testosterone along with your estrogen levels checked in your blood test. Then, of course, it makes sense to have the rest of your health markers checked as well. As a side note, Getting regular blood work to ensure you're healthy is something most lifters should do more often. If you're checking your car fluids more than your blood, ask yourself what matters more, your car or your health. You want to ensure that your testosterone and estrogen levels are within the normal ranges. If, for example, you discover that your testosterone is below the normal range or your estrogen is high, it's time to seriously consider some form of testosterone replacement therapy or an estrogen blocker. Now, these aren't illegal forms of steroid use. Instead, these optimize your health through supplementation like taking vitamin D pills if you don't get enough sun, or drinking a protein shake if you're low on protein. This leads us to the next step, which is fixing your diet. Number three, fix your diet. Regardless of whether you have general chest fat to lose or gyno, getting leaner will reduce the appearance of man boobs. Fixing your diet here means two things. First, you eat in a caloric deficit to reduce body fat and eat to optimize your hormonal health further. So let's begin with establishing a caloric deficit. To burn fat, you need to burn more calories than you consume. This deficit forces your body to break down tissue to be used as energy. Ideally, you're lifting weight and eating enough protein so that the breakdown is from the fat tissue and not muscle tissue. Many studies have shown that you can achieve fat loss with a wide variety of diets as long as the total calorie deficit is in place, including this International Society of Sports Nutrition's position on diets and body composition. How do you know if you're in a caloric deficit? Here are three ways to check. Number one, are you losing weight on the scale? Number two, are your waist measurements decreasing? Number three, do you visibly look leaner? Answering yes to one or any combination of these questions means you're making progress in the right direction. If you feel like you have stubborn chest fat, it simply means you have to be consistent for longer and you'll lose that fat later in the process. The chest fat will go, but it will just take a bit of consistency and patience. Next, you wanna optimize your diet to improve your hormonal health. One example of this is ensuring you're consuming enough dietary fats and eating enough protein. This recent 2021 systematic review and meta-analysis examined the associations between fat intake and testosterone in men. They included six eligible studies with a total of 206 participants. They concluded that low-fat diets appear to decrease both total and free testosterone levels in men. 
To ensure you're eating enough healthy fats while getting enough carbs and protein to support your training and gains, consume between 20 to 30% of your total calories from dietary fats. These fats can come from avocados, cheese, whole milk, and nuts. Number four, gym exercises for a bigger chest. Step number four is to build your chest with exercises done with weights. This includes the flat and incline bench press, barbell or dumbbell, weighted dips, chest flies, and many chest machine press variations. The more chest muscle you have, the less sag you'll notice in your chest. A pro tip is to focus on building your upper chest. One of the reasons men have the man boob look is because they don't have much muscle in the upper chest and chest fat sags to the lower chest. Several studies have looked at the best chest pressing angles to focus on the clavicular head, the upper chest muscle. While several studies have come to different conclusions, this recent 2020 study found that an angle of 30 degrees activated the upper chest the most. So if you have an adjustable bench, use a 30 degree angle where possible, but ultimately any angle between 30 and 45 degrees works well. So get your hands on some weights and start building a solid chest. Number five, body weight exercises to build your chest. Number five is to do body weight chest exercises on your off time. Ever wonder why calisthenics athletes or prisoners have massive chests? It's because all you need is the floor and the right mindset to get your reps in. Several studies have shown that you can build muscle with a lighter load and higher reps when taken to failure. One way to keep yourself accountable is to choose a target number of push-ups you do per day. Something as simple as 200 push-ups per day can undoubtedly transform your chest and help eliminate the look of man boobs. Number six, optimize your lifestyle. Reducing body fat and building muscle isn't something that only happens when you lift weight or slam back a protein shake. These processes are happening 24-7, 365 days a year. Our goal is to optimize these factors to align with the desired outcomes, more muscle and less fat. These are the biggest components to what you have to get right. Number one, consistent, high quality sleep. Number two, reduce stress. Number three, minimize junk food. Number four, eliminate bad habits like excessive alcohol or drug use. Number five, find ways to reduce medication that can affect hormones. Number six, spend more time getting sunlight or supplement with vitamin D. Number seven, be around women as this can boost your sex drive and natural testosterone. Number eight, meditate to relax the mind and minimize anxiety. Small amounts of short-term stress are a part of life and can be beneficial. It's similar to how resistance training puts stress on the body in a short period of time, but makes you stronger and healthier in the long term. On the other hand, chronic social stress, often arising from poor interpersonal relationships, job or unemployment stress, poor self-esteem, and low socioeconomic status have been associated with weight gain. So stress less and find ways to relax more. Number seven, do more cardio. Step seven is to do more cardio, especially if you live a sedentary lifestyle. Not only will doing more cardio improve your cardiovascular health, but it will burn additional calories and help you reduce body fat. A key benefit of cardio is that it allows you to create a caloric deficit we discussed earlier while consuming slightly more calories. More calories means more opportunities to consume healthy, nutritious food that can help optimize your hormones and physique. This certainly beats having to eat fewer and fewer calories because of low activity levels. So find a sport, cardio machine, or outdoor activity you enjoy and get moving. To quickly recap, get a second opinion to see if the man boobs are as bad as you think they are or if you're overreacting. Next, visit a doctor and get blood work to ensure your hormones aren't outside of normal ranges. If they are, discuss ways to fix that with a medical professional. After that, you want to follow all the diet and training advice we post on the Muscle Monsters YouTube channel to help you build a rock-solid chest while reducing body fat and getting leaner. If you follow these steps consistently, you will undoubtedly get rid of man boobs for life. Did you find this video helpful? If so, click the like button below as it'll genuinely help out the channel. If your training and nutrition are in order and you're looking for a bit of an edge, be sure to check out my science-based supplement line. Each product was created using scientifically proven ingredients, all clinically dosed and guaranteed to produce results. And right now, you can get 25% off your entire order, plus free shipping by using the coupon code MONSTER at checkout. So head over to musclemonsters.com supplements or click the link in the description. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe for more videos and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next one. Peace.